Magpie Dance has been running for 30 years. Um, there's a number of different programmes that we run, different adult and youth classes. Uh, the youth group's been running for 11 years now, which I'm part of, and I initially came along uh, and applied as the assistant of the youth group, which I've been doing for 11 years, and then this term I've just taken over as the director. I think there aren't that many companies out there that work inclusively through dance where the young people with learning disabilities are given complete kind of charge of the direction of the projects that they're doing. Um, so learning, learning the skills of inclusive dance practice. So I'm Nikki, I've been working for Magpie for about four years now. I initially started as a volunteer and came to this session about four and a half years ago. Um, I worked locally in Bromley and this session fitted in with the rest of my schedule so I managed to get involved and um, really, really loved it. It was great to be a part of the sessions and Magpie then started a training scheme which I was a part of um, and so I did a training course with them and then subsequently have worked as an assistant around various classes and now I'm back in the same class that I started in. Uh, it's great to be working with learning disabled people, just getting involved and producing dance is, is an amazing thing and it's a, it's a great fun job to have so I'm really enjoying it. First, it came into off of this. Um, I support all the dancers. Um, it's quite getting into it, yeah. yes, and learning the ropes, be a peer mentor. Um, it's quite good. It's trying to get them to focus and stuff. Yeah. So you began as a dancer. Yeah, I was dance. a dancer. Yes, I did bits of it in 2010, 2011. Okay. That, yeah, now I'm a bit mentor, so I mean, these are the dogs that I support. They're really doing really well, helping them to fight this and stuff. When you actually support the dancers, I mean, do you help them out? Do the actual routines? So it all sort of comes together? We do, or? we do do a routine yeah. and stuff. We have themes. Yeah, like yeah, yeah. the tango. Okay. We get in, we get like ideas. Oh, one idea and then another idea, and put them all together as a group. Did it take quite a lot of time to do that as well. Oh, uh, it does take a long. It, I think it does. Yes. We get used used to it, and it, it gets bigger and better, and other things as well. Bigger, better, bolder. Obviously, I don't, it's for special needs, and they haven't got anywhere to go really. And it's just taught them so much, and independence, confidence, friends. They just do, and the people who run it, Natasha and I think Nikki, they're absolutely brilliant. And they do loads of shows, don't they? And it's there's nowhere like it really. There's nowhere like it. So it's absolutely fantastic. looking for people to volunteer in the sessions it's great fun and it, it is great to have extra pairs of hands especially for when we're choreographing and creating dances it's great for our participants to just have that kind of one-to-one -one interaction and support as well um, it's a great atmosphere to kind of be a part of uh, and I'm sure you'd gain as much as all the participants as well <laughs> 